And how many men have you caught her with? Oh, I haven't caught her with any men. None? Oh. Do you spy on her from the woods? From my garage. What'd you see through the window? Her trying to find if the house was bugged still and pulling out furniture and stuff. I'd tear that bitch down to the studs if I were you. The doctor said I had chlamydia. When I went to the doctor, my results were clean. I know Cindy gave it to me. So you went to the doctor. You were never diagnosed with chlamydia. Not by paperwork. <laughs> I took this doctor's word. You gave us the note. Why would you give me a bogus note? He told me I had it 100%. I agreed to do this story for one reason. It's because y'all have a child that I think is really caught in the middle of some real chaos here. D did you tell your son, I don't know if I'm really your biological father? He overheard it. D did you feel that that was appropriate? Oh, no. No, that hurt me. I broke down. I, that, that killed me that I would have to put that kid through this over something like this. Have you like showed this. your son video of you guys arguing? No, not that I'm aware of. He, he, has, he may have seen it going on the computer or anything. I didn't just on, bring I, up a I video. I can't help the situation. No, I can't remember just it. sitting down and showing him a video of what was going on. He saw his videotaping around the house. Well, he stars in a lot of them. You have told him that you, you trick his mother, right? Yes. Do you tell your son about money problems? He hears it. it don't have to just go directly to him. He <clears> hears it. Did he grow up believing that his dad would kill his mother? Yes, he did. How, how'd you get that idea? By her saying these accusations <clears throat> in front of him on the phone all these years I was out working. I was on the phone with someone and I was telling him, yeah, if I did that, Mike would kill me. He overheard me But what do you think that? a kid takes Mike. out of that when he's a little kid and he hears it all his life to this age, Cindy? What do you think speech. a kid will take from that? down and say, my, your dad's You have no idea. Me. And this is all turning on me. You have no idea. You have no idea. Um, what do you mean this is all turning on you? This, this is the manip manipulation I've lived with all my life and blame myself. Yeah. How do, you, how do you think this interview is going? Not good right now. What Not would you, good. What would you say is wrong with this interview? So what's wrong with this interview is I'm angry. And it's what I showed the last two years. Do you think that she and I are conspiring against you? No, sir. You? No, I don't believe that. That's why I came to you. I wanted to hear it from your face. Yeah. Well, I got plenty to say. <laughs> so how does their son Stephen feel about all this? Has Mike completely alienated Cindy away from her child? Uh, I would actually like to speak to this young man. Uh, he's here. He's in the green room. Uh, he hasn't been hearing any of this, of course, because unlike his father, I don't think you involve children in adult issues. So I've had him sitting back there, but I'm very, very troubled by hearing this child scream at his mother. Do you have a story or a question for me? Click the link in the description and tell me what in the world is going on.